Did you actually have one? Joel just hooked up with one and then it came off last second. I'm going to that cove. If I don't start catching bass here pretty soon, I'm gonna to switch to a little swim bait or a creek bait. Got one. Ah. Oh, sorry. Got one. Got one. Woo! Good to see that there's actually bass in this pond. It's a feisty one. We're gonna get a little release on this guy. There he goes. Ooh, that's a good one. Right when it hit the water. What? Oh. Ooh. Fighting so hard. Dang. Nice little one. Hooked him pretty well. He was jumping a lot. Other way. There you go. This is a little Strike King. A little square bill. Little Sunfish crankbait works pretty well. Joel just hooked up with one little one pounder. Nice. All right, guys, moved to a new spot and I changed to the uh, trout colored whopper plopper. Seen a bunch of fish hit the top of the water, so I'm gonna see how this does. So many catfish right here, it is unbelievable. Ooh, I had him. Oh my gosh. I had him. Holy moly. I, it, I was mixed in with, with a worm. So that worm's red color leaked into it and it looks like a wounded shad. Oh, yeah. Dude. Alright guys, just hooked up with one. I wasn't recording. Pretty good one. Maybe two or three pounds. You fight like crazy in this lake. Jeez. Change to a little, oh shoot, he's a nice one. Three pounder. Switch to a little uh, jig head onto a Strike King Caffeine Shad. Yeah, these things work pretty good. I actually never caught one on one of those before. Nice little bass, I'm gonna snap a picture of him and let him go. Dude, he fought so hard. That was about a two pounder. Alright guys, we're heading out now. Caught a couple of bass on the swim bait, caught a bass on the crankbait. Joel got a catfish on a crankbait. So yeah, not exactly what we thought about this lake, but still caught some bass. But anyways, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like and what? Share with your friends, subscribe. Yeah, see ya.